Hey you guys, my name is Pizza. Welcome back to another video. Today we have a lot of new Fortnite leaks that are actually coming out to the game. It is very early, so that's why if I'm talking a little bit quiet or anything like that. And my game is still updating, so I'm still not 100% sure what's in the game yet. So if I do show some, uh, show some stuff that's actually in the game already, I apologize for that. But I'm actually not too sure if they've actually released the Fortnite X Mayhem like challenges and skins and everything like that. But... We're going to be looking at all the new cosmetics here, and then we'll go in and look at uh, more detailed photos of each thing. So here we have the Rogue Spider Shield, which is a backling. And this is going to come with the Rogue Spider Knight, which I'm guessing is just a, another style for the uh, Spider Knight, I think is what it's called. I don't know. Then we have the Containment Pack, which I don't know if has already been in the game or not. Uh, the Starfield and Infinity skins and backling i know have already been released to the game so those aren't actually new yet and then we have the psycho bandit which i think is from uh I'm trying to remember I, I forgot what game it was borderlands borderlands that's what it was okay um and then we have the vulture skin here i like both these skins a lot because we're, we're gonna be getting a lot of like wasteland type skins or just uh mad max style skins i guess you could say uh, which I really like those types of uh, skins and style. It's really interesting to me. Kind of like the, uh, uh, I'm not sure. There, there's some skins in the game that are already kind of like designed around this, but I forgot what they're called. But uh, if I can remember them, I'll say them. But yeah, Psycho Bandit from Borderlands. And if any of these other characters are from other games, I'm, I'm sorry, I don't really play uh, Borderlands or anything like that. Um, then we have the Vulture skin, which looks really cool. I'm guessing is going to come with the Containment Pack back bling, just based on how that's blue and uh how the skin over here has blue and you know it kind of matches up then we have the claptrap pet which is cool i'm guessing that's going to go with the psycho bandit just because the color schemes match and everything like that so that's pretty cool i like that it's pretty cool it's kind of like a wally -E, which i'm guessing this is from borderlands as well but i just don't really recognize it because i don't play the game then we have the stronghold backling which I guess could also go with the Psycho Bandit. I'm not really too sure. Um, pretty cool. Once again, Mad Max type style uh, backling here, which is pretty cool to see. Then we have the Jitterbug emote. Uh, I don't think we have any gameplay of the emotes yet, so all you have to look at is the uh, actual image there. So Jitterbug, Llama Conga, that's or whatever. <laughs> um, I'm trying to imagine what that is because it's like it looks like he's holding something, but I can't tell what it is. I don't know. Then we have the dual def defiant, defiant, whatever, um, glider, which I'm guessing is going to go with the vulture skin because the color schemes, once again, match pretty well. And then we have the stunt cycle, which uh, seems like it's going to go with the psycho bandit, uh, the glider, uh, just because, once again, the color schemes match the yellow or orange with the pants and uh, everything like that. And uh, I think this is the glider that goes with the... Uh, Oh my god, I, I literally, I cannot remember any skins this morning. I don't know why, but you guys know what I mean. What, you've seen this glider before, probably. Then we have the blue bolt pickaxe, which is going to go with the vulture skin, most likely, just because he has one of those blue vials in the middle, like he has on the skin and the back wing. So that's what I'm going to guess. Psycho buzz axes, which I'm guessing is going to go with the psycho bandit, because as you can see in his hands there, he does have them in his hands. That's pretty cool to see. <laughs> And then, going back over here, we had the Star Strike, which we've already seen, Llama Beat. So, I don't think we have this yet, and that's pretty cool to see, because I was actually thinking about this a couple days ago, saying, like, why don't we have a Llama Bell uh, music, like, background music from the Llama Bell emote, and then now it looks like we're going to be getting that, which is really cool. And then we have the Aeronaut skin, which is the same as the Sky Stalker. Uh, but without his mask or his uh, gas mask and then kind of a robotic face. And this looks like it's only going to be 800 V-Bucks. And if it is, definitely going to buy that skin. Because out of all these League skins, Aeronaut is my favorite. Um, it just looks pretty cool in my opinion. And then we have Sledge. Pretty cool. Pretty uh, big skin. It looks cool, but I don't think I'll buy it because I feel like it'll be... Uh, kind of like the same problem with Ragnarok where it's too bulky. You know, it takes up too much of the screen. It's just, you know, not not worth it, you know, for the gameplay disadvantage and everything like that. Then we have the Angular Flow Wrap, which I'm all, I'm guessing is going to go with Vulture. And then we have the Square Stream, which I'm guessing is going to go with Psycho Bandit. Or maybe they won't. Maybe they'll just be by themselves in the shop without anything else. 
Um, so yeah, I guess they're, they both look like they'll be animated, so that's pretty cool to see. Um, I think the angular flow will be cool, but the square stream, I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it, you know, just based off that image there. <laughs> then we have the moto case back bling, uh, which I think might go with the hard charger down here, um, just based on just quick glancing and seeing the colors and everything like that. Then we have the hang on emote, which, uh, I mean, I don't know. We only have an image, so I guess you can't really tell what it'll actually be. Then we have the arrow X, which I'm guessing will go with the arrow knot, just because it says arrow, arrow, you know, everything like that. Then we have the impact edge pickaxe, which I'm guessing is going to go with the sledge skin, just based on how everything looks there. Then we have the loading screen, which is like toxic waste kind of stuff. Uh, loading screen here, which shows... Uh, Kevin Island or whatever you want to call it and it says the return which is really cool to see um, I'm guessing we're going to be getting that back then uh, the Kevin Island just based on this one loading screen once again we have the hard charger skin here which looks really cool I like all the skins that have masks like that those are pretty cool then we have the crunk bunny spray the psycho spray uh, I'm guessing these are going to come from completing challenges for the uh, because there is going to be challenges that come out if they're not already out in the game um, for the Fortnite X Mayhem. So I'm guessing that's what you're going to be able to get. And then we have the finger finger fingerprint wrap. I cannot speak. Okay, uh, fingerprint wrap, which is looks like it'll be animated, which seems like it'll be pretty cool. So that's nice. Then we have the Mayhem wrap here, which I'm guessing is going to come from the actual. Um, you know, challenges when you complete them. I'm guessing everything that you hear that says uh, event in parentheses next to uh, the wrap or spray means that it's going to be coming out. Like, you can get it from completing challenges and stuff. Then, we, lastly, we have the taffy wrap, which does not seem like it'll be animated, uh, seeing as it's also going to be 300 V-Bucks, or not 300, uh, 800 or 300, I'm guessing. Uh, which is hard charger, I'm guessing, isn't going to be 300 either, just because it's green rarity. So, maybe these rarities aren't fully accurate, but I don't know. I guess uh, I guess we'll find out. But, yeah, looks pretty cool, pretty colorful wrap, which it's always nice to see colorful wraps, because in my opinion, I always would rather see a colorful wrap than just a, a bleak wrap, you know, a boring wrap and everything like that. So, yeah, we got a lot of new leaks here, a lot of really good skins uh, hopefully good emotes, you can't really tell. Good gliders, in my opinion. The dual def Defiant looks pretty cool, in my opinion. Really like that. And, uh, yeah, if you guys enjoy this or you want to see more Fortnite leaks, Fortnite info, daily item shop videos, and everything like that, make sure to subscribe down below and turn on that notification bell so you can see whenever a new video out or whenever I'm live streaming. Also, make sure to go follow me on Twitter, subscribe to my second channel, and join my Discord. Links to all three of those will be down in the description below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.